that on that beat. Oh. Live from Jerome Harden Studios. This is the latest on my newscast I'm willing to tell you about. So as you sit back, relax, chillax, and I'll tell you the latest stuff. What's up on JR? You chilling all right? Let's get started. Guess where I am right now at this time? I'm in Lake Gunnersville right now. As you can see, the scenery is so beautiful and the lakes are so lovely. Just look at that water splashing right here. And um, it's almost just like a beach. But if you just feel your feet under it, it'll just feel like a cold wire, which just feels so nice. But um, yeah, right here you can see a bunch of seashells right here. So I don't know, you can just take you a few of them if you want. But just don't take a whole lot, okay? Well. Well, it's just so nice out here. You can just um, just chill, relax, and just enjoy the air. But on this Saturday right now, um, it's supposed to be so nasty tonight. It's supposed to have heavy storms. And over at the uh, southern part of Tennessee, um, they have some uh, tornado warnings in effect right now. So, lucky for us, it wasn't here at this time. So... I would give um, 8 o'clock for the storms hit, so, you know, five. I might just want to enjoy this uh, view out here for the storm hits, okay? So, um, yeah, see some ducks right here. And even though uh, i never been been to Lake Gunnersville before, I did went to Point Mallard, but I didn't get to record the uh, whole thing because, you know, I had some trouble. So, yeah, I got those out of the way. So, yeah. Even though I never been to Lake Gunnersville, once again, all I see is uh, they even have a walking trail over here. I don't know where it ends up, but um, hopefully it'll end somewhere and uh, it'll be a nice time to walk. But uh, if it's storming, of course, um, it wouldn't be a good time either. Yeah, some people just walking down the trail, just enjoying this uh, last moment of nice weather for the storm hit so yeah wonder if I can find some good shows for my hermit crabs but yeah I bet the hermit crab wouldn't like that if I give them these right but uh, yeah so I just might as well just keep walking and just uh, show y'all what I can yeah just where you can have lunch at only if they got picnic tables around this area so thought uh might want just uh, do the walking trail since uh my plans got canceled cuz I was supposed to do something special tonight but uh unfortunately I can't cuz you know the storm's supposed to be nasty when it's supposed to be picking up and it's supposed to be heavy so it will be difficult to drive in those conditions but uh Instead of uh, sitting bored at home till the storms hit, I'll find I'll find something else to do. So you know, whatever makes me happy, I'm cool with it. Yeah, I got a little upset because uh, my plans got ruined and stuff. And then these uh, stupid storms every summer just rain every day, storm every day, like uh, for real. It's just sometimes it can get annoying. Okay. Yeah, just follow the little bitty gray road right here. See where it ends up to. Wonder what these places are over there right there. So, how about I just take you over there and, you know, we'll just explore what these places are and what do they do and, I don't know. Just, I just like exploring, okay? I mean, I, as much as y'all people, I mean, I know, I understand y'all got work and you got to go to college and stuff. But as for me, I hate being bored a lot. And when I'm alone and bored, I find something to do. So, yeah. I wonder what this tree is. It would be the Southern Magnolia Tree. Igmagnine and Wayne Foster Southern Magnolia and it's dated 1937 2010 1939 2000. yeah the same thing so it's a nice tree right here yep let's just keep 
Just keep going, folks. Yeah, they have, even though it's trail, even, they even got street lights over here. Wow. Now, over at Ditter Landing, they barely even got a thing going on. Like, there are no street lights, there are no walking trails, except the little walking trail from uh, Mountain Gap Road ends uh, at Ditter Landing. So, other than that, it don't got nothing. Except a little volleyball court, of course, and a nice sunset view to the west if you look. Now, these are the places I'm talking about. I don't know what they are, but ooh, I see little picnic tables over here, so this must be where people can eat and uh, conversate. So, yeah, pretty nice stuff. Well, I see some people over there too, so. I guess that's where the places where people can go and have lunch, dinner, or just chill and have fun. So, right when it nears seven minutes, I'm going to end my newscast and call it a day. Hmm. Whoop. It's pretty nice out here, I tell you what. Well, it's after seven minutes, but uh probably make a part two or maybe not. Whatever I feel and so um hope you enjoyed this little walk with me. But until next time, if there's a part two, I'm J Dog, I'm out, peace.